hi friends welcome back to my channel thank you so very much for clicking on this video so today we have a review um, of this Gucci so it's this Gucci shoe um, I think it is called let me open it and I'll tell you what it is called <laughs> so I did unbox this okay um, I got this from Marshall you know Marshall and TJ Maxx they're linked um, Marshall do carry online the website they do carry um, luxury stuff designer stuff but not as much as TJ Maxx I think TJ Maxx is like the mother of all like the boss of all you know so um, and I got this shoe it's called La Gucci leather held sandal with logo detail um, and I got it in size 38 because I wear a size 38 and this is where I got it I'm just blocking my address um, and this is how much it was for him um, I got this, I saw this online, um, this is the 5.26 inch inch heel, so it's a very um, tall, but then it has like this platform, so it makes it more, a little bit more comfortable, okay, this is how it's packaged, it definitely comes in this plastic bag, and then two of those, it comes with two dust bags, which I love Gucci for, um and then it comes with like the instructions and i guess like the letter what they use for the letter and it comes with this even this thing is very soft okay it feels luxurious so let's get into the shoe i like the fact that they put it in plastic bags so that both of them don't rub against each other to create some sort of friction and create some sort of like uh tear um wear or something so this is how the shoe looks i'm gonna go ahead and take out this even this thing feels very soft it feels very luxurious it better because i think the original the um retail price of this is like nine hundred and thirty dollars <laughs> wow so it is this chunky shoe i'm gonna bring it closer so you can look at every glue <laughs> um how it looks okay because i love to look at that when i buy shoes and every stitching because it is very very important that you if you're spending so much money that the glue and the stitching is perfect i know there's nothing like perfection but you're spending a lot of money on these shoes um and over there it says gucci oh i think i should do it this way uh let me see if this is gonna focus this gucci and they're made in Italy, size 7. It's just so smooth, like smooth, but um, here have smooth leather. Okay, I like the fact that it's black right here, so rather than white, so you can easily clean it. Oh, this is all leather, and then they just have that um, Gucci made in Italy written back there. So when you look at this. It has a GG rather um so this shoe is what um I got it for two hundred three two hundred six hundred and fifty dollars six hundred forty nine whatever um do I like I mean I love the way it feels it's a little bit heavy okay I wore it around the house I'm not keeping it I'm returning it and I just got it for the sake of review and um, i'm not keeping it is it what the price i just think most things that we're buying these days they're not completely what the price we're just buying it because of the name okay um i've seen the sw carry this for less cheap i think cheaper than 
six hundred dollars if in case you're looking for um more like one of like this type of shoe they carry gucci um the, the dsw online do so you can um follow them check out their website and see when i wore this my toe mind you i don't have like a very wide toe uh um leg uh foot sorry my toe pop out right here and i hate to see shoe i hate that if you wear shoe that your toe pop out right here my heel was a little bit i normally wear a 37 38 or 38 and a half my heel stopped right there okay um right here it just feel like this this because of this gg there's a little bit hump right here and it just feels a little uncomfortable i know people might say go up in size but if I go up in size i feel like my foot my foot is just gonna slide as i go especially like in the noon time or whenever you sweat your foot because this is not this is not except i guess if you have wider foot then maybe but this is not giving me that whole back kind of like strap that i need I like hold my toes back from sliding back uh forward um i don't for comfort wise i'll probably give it like um seven and that's because i wore it like around the house i'm not sure if you wear it out i've heard um i've seen other people review that they say that it's comfortable but this is not my kind of style of shoe it's too chunky for me um it's a little bit too high even though it has a platform um it i just don't like the way it makes my toes when i put it on um, I like my toes to be slim like this, but my toes just goes like this. <laughs> it just separates my toes because I guess I'm grabbing against like the slope, the slope. Okay, so um, another thing I don't really like is like shoes that have like this um, color, like more brighter color here because I know you wash your feet, but sometimes you step on floors that are a little bit dusty and if you put it put your shoe it will just accumulate a lot of dirt i just don't know this trap here is very fine um i guess it it's doing its work the only thing again i don't like is this like when i buckle it and i try to push this trap through this it's really hard for me to do like i keep pushing and pushing like it doesn't have you know some of the um other shoe have like like elastic of on the hip uh, behind here where if you pull then it will come higher a little bit more but this is really hard to like go through this but um would i buy this shoe maybe if this shoe was like on sale for like 200 dollars apart from my clothes popping up right there I'll probably get it because it's not like it's a shoe that you're gonna wear every day it's over unless you work in the office or something or you're a party girl but maybe but for like an everyday wear uh, nah, this is not really this is not really it so but well that's my just quick review for this shoe if it is a cup of tea you can go for it they have disadvantages they have advantages advantages is that it's gucci <laughs> it has a logo everyone will know that you're wearing gucci which doesn't make sense you give your height because it's 5.26 inch in height um i guess it make you feel a lot better but for the disadvantages i don't know if it's worth that price it's a little bit heavy i've seen people talk about this thing here popping out popping off after like a couple years so, um, I don't know about this, like my toes, my big toe hanging out here. My nah, dad was a no-no. The low discomfort that I got from this little hump. And then if I go up in size, obviously, um, it's not even going to work. So, um, this trap is a little bit cheaper, but it just feels a lot cheaper. Because, I mean, I felt other shoe, like contemporary shoe that have more quality than this, like the Stuart Wiseman um, heel that I have. Maybe I should show you that. Okay, I just when I brought this, like this, 
this is this two Weissman shoe that I have check out the strap do you see how chunky the strap is um I only I got this on clearance from T, uh, from Macy's look at how thick and look good quality the um, leather feels and the buckle just gives you more room um this here this here is chunky enough to fit in easily you know um for this this is how the buckle look this is how the leather looks let me concentrate let me see yeah this is it just feels so cheapy um it's a all leather shoe it says gucci right there i forgot to tell you come on why are you not so it says gucci right there by the strap and yeah i'm gonna go ahead and return it is that a wait what is that oh wow that's a trade okay I'm not just, I'm not being too critical, I hope. I just, you know, if you're buying a shoe of this amount of money, I just need an, a very honest review. I, you know, most people that's in the video talk about how comfortable it is. I mean, that might probably be their um, experience, but as everybody's experience is different. So this is just my experience that I'm trying to let you know, so you could just decide. You know, even the review that I read says that it's some people say it's not, some people say it's it is comfortable, so it's up to you to decide. Oh, what is that? Okay, so they say it's Gucci rather. Hmm, I just not sure. I'm not really like comfortable paying this amount of money on a shoe. <laughs> yeah, so that's my review for this original original price ninety nine hundred and thirty. Um, Marshall had it for six forty nine. And I think DSW have it for way cheaper than that. So, and then if you get it on clearance, it's even better. Okay. But, um, is this going to be an everyday shoe? No. Um, I guess it's up to you if you want to wear it when you're in, a, in your 50s. But I don't, I don't know. The heels for me at this age is really not, I'm not like, I'm over it. So, but it's up to you. <laughs> okay. Do not forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you in my next video. Bye bye now.